Good morning guys, welcome to another vlog. I have headed to Huddersfield. Not been here for quite a number of years. I'm from, I'm from Huddersfield. Uh, used to go shopping in Huddersfield quite a lot. But uh, not been to the market for I would say nearly 30 years. So I'm gonna walk around the market with the Waterstones to collect a book for Zarina, she's ordered some books. So I have a walk through Huddersfield Town Centre and uh, show you guys how Huddersfield has changed over the past 30 odd years. I would say that's a new Huddersfield uh, Ledge Centre. The sports centre used to be the other end of town. That cost about 35 million to build. And uh, this is this is the parking area for Huddersfield, really. There's a subway to the bus station. It's quite cold today. Town centre. Straight on, or ledge then to turn right. I don't know where that girl goes. Go this way. These are the council offices. High street buildings, town hall, library and art gallery, straight on. That is the bus station. Customer service centre, I think that's Kirklees Council. I think it is. You got a job centre down there. We're gonna cross over the road here because I need to check something out. Abbey Ways. Does anybody remember Abbey Ways? That's like an old tour operator. I think it's closed now. Abbey Ways Hansen. Wow. That's been there some years. This used to be a butcher shop. Something like first first butchers or something. Right next to Thread Needle Street. I'm going to walk this way now, back into town. There's another council building across there. I'm sure that is the register office. I don't know if it's still there, but it used to be the register office. This used to be a, furni a furniture shop. This is another old building, look at this. Looks like an old Edison sign. It's probably from the 60s. I don't know if uh, you guys remember that. It used to be our price music. I did my uh, work experience there. And that is uh, the town hall. A lot of concerts go on there. A lot of big names come to Huddersfield. And that's where they perform. This is the market. There's rumours that they're closing it down. So we're going to take a walk through the market. This is the piazza. A lot of these stores uh, are closed. That's the library, what a building. Art gallery and library, it's a really nice place. Got the library downstairs. At one time, it used to be downstairs as well. Oh, it is downstairs. Let's have a walk through the piazza. We're going to do the market after the bookshop. At one time, uh, they used to turn the Christmas lights on here. This Greg's has been here for years. It used to be uh, a, a bakery called Thurston's about 30 odd years ago. But that's always been a bakery. A lot of these are closed now. It's a shame really. When I was a kid, it was quite busy down here. You used to have British home stores right at the end. Okay, this used to be British home stores. I think it's, it's just closed. It's closed now. Retail unit to let, that's closed. That's a big, big, big store. Across there, where Poundland is, that used to be uh, Woolworths. And uh, the unit here at the end, that used to be Yorkshire Electricity Board. I'm gonna walk this way now. 
One thing I've, I've noticed is uh, they've put a roof down the middle here. Hidden wardrobe. Oh, this boots has been here for years. This is still the old, well, this is the building for the British Home Stores. It was huge. Smith's is still here. In its original place. This is a Kingsgate Centre. I've actually never been in here. That foot asylum used to be uh, Burger King. Before that it was Hilton Shoes. And down there to the Lawrence Battler Theatre. We are walking here now. Yeah, it's busy down here. you got Greg's down here as well. TK Maxx. We might go into TK Maxx. This is the Packard Centre. Got American Sweet Shop. Love a Reese, love them. This is the Packard Centre, not been here for like 30 odd years. This way, gym upstairs. Oh, Mary England, maybe going there. I think there's another one. It's quite nice in here. Card factory. It used to be a pound stretcher. On the left hand side. Yeah. Which probably won't be there now. Yeah, it's where that, uh, the cafe is. That used to be a pound stretcher. Oh, that might be a pound stretcher. One, one of them used to be a pound stretcher. That used to be a news agent's. Simpson. Now, anybody remember Tandy? The electronics place that used to be just there. Tandy. Sports shops. There's quite a few empty units in here. But it's quite nice. So the old Tandy is now a Noodle King. You like noodles, don't you, Zarina? Your favourite. But we're going to Merit England, which is just around here, hopefully. Oh, Ryan's. Anybody remember Ryan's? That used to be a, a news agent's. That's long gone. You got the church, that's nice. So we're gonna go here. Merit England coffee shops. There's quite a few of these in Uddersfield. Quite a lot of them. We're not going to that one. We're gonna go to this one instead. This Merit England. I think it's quiet to this one. Opposite Ramsden's. Okay, we're not going to that cafe either because Zarina wants chips and I like chips, so Merry England don't serve chips. So we're finding a really nice grease spoon, like weather spoons. No, possibly, possibly not. We'll head to uh, the market hall, I think. We're heading up the Piazza Centre now and we're going to go to Queensgate Market see if there's any cafes in there, it used to be many years ago so see how many cafes are left Right, this is the entrance to the Queensgate Market next to meet Steve Got a shoe repairs you got a button box, I cannot believe a button box is still here. I used to go there as a kid, button box. Sell all sorts of fabrics and things. Tattoo and piercing. Another butcher's. Used to be a cafe down there. It looks like it's gone. Rice and noodle cafe. Sweet shop. Alice's kitchen. So a cafe down here. 
at the building. I think it's rather impressive. This is a big market. I'll turn left here, I think. It looks like a lot of it's closed off. How we can get around here? Wow. Here's some cafes at the end of here. What if it's closed? It's a shame that. This is where the cafes used to be. See some cafes in there. They've gone. That's a nice bit of history just there. Such a shame. Most of the market isn't here now. It's all uh, fenced off. Used to be an egg stall just here. That used to be an egg stand. Hatfield Slayer Bakery. We have come to Lynn's. Lynn's Cafe, and this is at the entrance of Queen's Gate Market. After about 20 minutes, we've got burger chips, onion rings, egg and tomato sandwich, hot sandwich, or tea cake. What do you, I call it tea cake. Or bread cake or bap or bam. And I'm gonna get another coffee. Coffee's good. So that's Huddersfield Town Centre. Got some sausages for the market. I got about two pounds of sausage. Four. Four quid. Is that cheap? I don't know. Thanks for watching guys. Please like, subscribe, please leave a comment. I shall return with a future vlog. Take it easy. Oh, 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 oh,